hey guys welcome back to my channel so this is a continuation um this is a video of how i'm going to install the wash the washing machine i don't know if you've seen the video where i unboxed it if you've not seen that video you can go and check it out where i unboxed the washing machine so now this is the fixing of it and um i'm trying to fix it in and connect it the way i'm supposed to then we'll now use it and see how it is so this is the connection here i'm not doing I have this connection here because some people um some people put it in their bathroom or something but i will put in my hair this is just under the staircase this is where i want to put mine so guys um let's continue and if you're new here you're welcome if you're a returning subscriber thank you for coming back please and please don't forget to subscribe to the channel so um here i have my i have a, on a, on an automatic washing machine i was using here before so i said okay since i already have the uh, the plumber did something here for me he did um this connection here i don't know if you guys can see it very well he did this connection here for me so i say why not continue with it since i already have something like this here before so we're just going to continue the plumber is he was here already to connect it but the, the hose that came with it is very short it's very short and I don't want to push this machine backwards too much. I don't want the situation whereby I want to pull clothes. I'll be bending down to pull clothes. Like, see, you can see this place is not really um, high. It's under the staircase. So he has gone to get um, a hose to join to this. So it will be long enough to connect to this place. See, it's very short. So you are getting something to add to it. So you can block and connect it. Here. This is for the um to take in water it will be connected inside this place to take in water why this is for the waste water to go out it will be connected inside this place here he's going to get a rubber something to tight it and we we'll just put it in this way so it takes water out by itself and bring water in so this is the connection right here. So I'm waiting for him to get the, the hose to make this one longer because the one that came with the machine is not that long. See, and I don't want to push this machine backwards. And I, as I'm making this video, I'm bending. So I don't want a situation whereby I'll be washing. I have to bend to wash. So that's why I brought it out here. And this is 11 kg high sense washing machine manual so guys i was using automatic before like and it was 6 kg so i wanted to get something bigger and i said okay let me just um declutter that one and get another bigger size guys i went to the to the showroom and all the automatic automatic machines there are from 200k and above like the list i saw was 190 something thousand i was like no 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 i don't have that amount right now like so i have to opt to like get the man i've never used manual before i hope i like it i just hope so so this is it so i'm just going to wait for him to do the connection they will put in some clothes in and wash and let's see how it is so i'll be back guys hi welcome back guys so the plumber is done with fixing like this is what he did here uh, this is quite dark i hope you guys can see okay so this is the hose that came with it he, he added something to it he added this straw one and clipped it in there and this is the the one for the drainage to remove the wastewater this is it so all i need to do is why using this i just come here and only because this is this is going to be a lot of work like i have to turn it on here to use wow oh lord i wish my automatic machine <laughs> oh god this is how i have to do like my automatic machine yeah i just own it put in my soap and put, set it to what i want and it start washing by coming back to this place is when it's dry i just take it out and when it's um washed i just take it out and dry but this i have to be here 
wow is <laughs> people that be using manga is this what you guys go through oh lord help me so like i have to go there on it on the water before i can use it wow this is huge okay guys let's see um i've gone through the manual so this is the cover here and uh, you can hang this here this is where yes you can hang it here if you want and this uh, this thing inside is the water level if you check very well that is medium low and high so it just helps you know where you want to put your water so you don't over put water in there so let's turn this on and see so um okay let's on the water wow i just hope that to reduce the noise <laughs> so when the water gets in there according to the manner when the water gets in, you put in your your soap and spin it for a while before you put in your clothes then this place is for the dry for the spinning while you're washing your clothes i hope you guys can hear me while you're washing the clothes and after washing and you want to spin maybe the clothing rates very well here and you want you're spinning it here you can as well on the water to this place to spin it very well see while it's spinning it should be raising and spinning at the same time if we didn't raise here very well. So we're going to try that out and see. So let's get in some water here and some soap and uh, we'll continue the video. So I think this water is enough. I'm not using this for the first time, guys. <laughs> let's take it gently while we get into it. So um, this is for the, the timer for how long you want to wash so after putting your detergent you have to spin it for a while so the soap mix together before adding in your clothes so this is if you want to wash it on um, gentle wash that's for washing light clothes or light material use the gentle if you want hard like i'm going to wash jeans now i think i'm going to use this standard for it for washing the jeans and don't forget to always put it in your wash and this is here. This is the drainage. If you put it in this drainage while washing, all the water will drain out. So make sure it's in this um, wash and rinse. Oh, sorry, wash and rinse something. So this is 11 kg washing machine. So I'm just going to put in some clothes in here now. So guys, I added some jeans inside and I'm washing it for nine minutes. I don't know if it's too much to wash for nine minutes. I want to add some jeans here. I think I don't have enough there. Should I add more? Let's wash this and see. Okay, let's just wash this and see how it says, how it goes. I think I have enough soap there, enough water. I can just add more. This is 11 kg now. I can take more. Let's just add some more there since we still have more time. Okay, let's do, let's make do with this one. So why it wash? So you can cover it if you want. I think covering it reduces the noise. Huh? Did you reduce the noise? So I'll bring you guys back when it's done washing. Okay, let's let it wash for a while. itself like my automatic washing machine because when that one is done washing it just okay it doesn't look off by itself but it stops it stops and off itself yeah my automatic off itself so this is getting to off now let's see if it's going to off stop or we have to do it manually 
Wow, I think I like, I'm liking it too. It, it washes fast. But does it wash neat? Let's find out. Let's find out. Wow, it's tops. Okay. So, okay, what do we do next? I think we should drain the water. Um, we're going to set this here. And the water is draining already. You can also, uh, while draining the water, you can leave it on this. Um, let's like say like um, one minute, so it turns while it drains, it spins while it drains out water. I think the water is not draining out fast. Or is it? too much detergent to it next time i'm going to reduce the detergent i won't add up to this so while you're washing yours be careful not to add so much detergent so this is, i think this adding so much detergent disadvantage now is it's going to take me more time to rinse so the water is draining now so when it's done draining i think you will now oh, okay we're putting another water in to rinse it this time without detergent Oh god, I put more detergent. It's going to take me a lot of time to rinse. So I think it's done draining now. So I'm going to add water and add water on it. So I'm going to add some water and rinse it out. So let's you take it back to wash and rinse. Wow, this advantage of putting so many detergents. So this is the third time I'm rinsing it. Guys, next time if you sorry if you're washing yours, don't put too much detergent. So now the water is draining. We we'll just go ahead and um, uh, uh, dry it. This dryer is quite big. Wow, it's quite big. So just put this in. Why it's why it's spinning? I think I'll, I'll add in more water because I still have some um, some detergent here, like foam. I think I'll just paint more for now and see. Okay, let's paint this for now and see how it goes. I hope this is not what causes. Take this to spin. Okay. I'll just do this and spin it at the same time. Since I still have some um, soapy thing there. So, guys, if you don't cover it, it's not going to spin. You have to cover it. And let's see for three minutes and see what we can get to that three minutes.
open it to stop spinning. So you have to make sure it's closed while you spin. So let's spin it for three minutes and see how it gets. So it's a stop. Um, this is hair dry. Let's see how how it dried it. If okay, take it as top. Okay. Well, I hope it dries very well. Wow. Wow. It's it did. Where is the coming out of it? Where is this thing coming out of it? This thing spoils clothes. Jesus me. See my wow. Oh, it's spoiled. Oh, wow. I will call this off. See what this machine did to this cloak. Wow. Well, it did spin it. Uh, let's see if we can bring out any water. Oh, wow, no water. It's like wow, I love this. It dried almost dry, almost dry. So, I'm just going to go ahead and put the rest in. Wow, it's almost dry. Like, and this is a gin, guys. I love it. So, I'll just go ahead and put in the rest. I think I just I just put small there before because I'm trying it for the first time. I think it, it can take more clothes. I think it can take more. So because I put in um, too much soap before, I'm still going to do it the same way I did it before by rinsing and spinning it at the same time. On the On the water. So I'm just going to do it for let's put it back in two minutes. So I just on the water there to remove the soapy thing there because I added enough to more detergent of course. So I'll just do it for a while and off it back and allow the clothes to get dry. So the way this is drying, I think I'll just go ahead and add more clothes here and wash. So guys, um, I'll come back when this is done. So I'm just going to watch this set for about six minutes. So while this is washing, let's check on the one with the drying a uh, drying earlier. Wow. 
almost dry. So guys, thank you so much for watching. If you've watched up to this point, please don't forget to subscribe. I'm just going to go ahead and finish doing my laundry. I think I'm loving it already. It's nice and it washes fast. Ah, oh, I hope I don't miss my automatic so much. I don't think I will miss it. The only difference I have to remove clothes from here and put it here, go on the water. Oh wow. I'll get used to it. I'll get used to it. So thank you guys for watching overall. I think I love it. And have you used it? Are you using it? How has it been for you? Let me know in the comment section. I'll see you in my next video. Bye.